Hey, my berries. It's me, Darkberry32. Okay, y'all, I know I have a great explanation of why you guys did not get a video from me this weekend and a video from me this past week. I did something stupid. Okay, most of y'all know I live in the Houston, Texas area. And I'm into football. Well, <clears throat> watching the Houston Texans play those doggone Patriots a couple weekends ago, I hurt my back because I was too busy jumping up and down and cheering. However, on that Sunday, I didn't know I hurt my back until that Monday. I got up and I thought maybe I slept wrong in my bed and my back was killing me all day. Luckily, I had took that day off. However, went to work on Tuesday, could not sit at my desk in pain like crazy. So I ended up coming home and I, I was in this bed all week, all weekend long, except for yesterday, I decided to get out of the bed sit on my sofa and take a leave instead of the other medication that I was taking, which all it did was put me to sleep, and, but it made my back relax, you know. So anyway, I am back. Um, I did go to work today. It was hard. God, it was hard sitting in that chair all day, but I did take a, like a, a pillow, a roll pillow, and I put it in my back and kind of kept my feet elevated. But I took a leave today, and hopefully the leave is going to help with taking down whatever swelling or inflammation I have in my back. So anyway, I just want to come to you guys with an outfit of the day because I didn't have any outfits of the day last week because I was in my bed wearing my pajamas all the time. So here we go. Let's start at the bottom. I did really relax today because I didn't know how I was going to feel, so I didn't put on any heels. But um, I just have on my little flats here. And then I have on my uh, black skinny jeans from Macy's. This blue shirt, I think it came from Kohl's. Yeah, it came from Kohl's. And then I just paired it with the vest to try to juice it up a little bit because I was like, Lord, what am I going to feel like today when I go to work? And then um, for my jewelry, I have on these bracelets here. I showed you guys these before. And I got them from um, our grocery, a grocery store. They're like 99 cents in this bracelet also. I got this one. And then I have on my watch here. Um, I have on a pair of loops. And then, as you can see, my hair, I just, it's, you know, a nice soft look. I'm thinking about coloring it and nothing crazy. I just think I'm going to go black. Because I know, know y'all probably like, your hair is black. But when you look at it in the light, it's like that brown color whatever. If you guys follow me on Facebook, I posted something about going to the thrift store last weekend, which was not this past weekend, but the weekend before, which was a Saturday. And I found some Manolo Blahniks for $6.99. Well, here they are. If you follow me on, on Facebook, you'll, you'll um, know that I had I talked about these, but I never did show them. These are the Manolo Blahniks that I got for, look at that, $6.99, guys. And... Um, I think these things run at least $600, $700, something like that. But I got these. And then my daughter and I are sharing these. Actually, she's already worn these. But aren't these the cutest shoes? These are so cute. And she wore this with a skirt. And then my mom bought her a pair of pants that goes great with these type of shoes. So, yeah, we got these. I think these were $6.99 also. Yeah, $6.99 also. I thought they were really, really cute. So, yeah. But um, I'm going to take the camera now. And I want to show you guys some else, some other stuff that I got. Like, like I got this tree here. My niece got me this tree. Excuse the mess over here. But my niece got me this tree um, for my jewelry and everything. And I really use it a lot, as you can tell. And I like it because I can put it right here on my vanity. And then I can reach for all the jewelry that I wear from, you know, like normal day-to-day -day stuff. So that was one of my Christmas presents. And believe it or not, guys, this shelf here. I found this shelf uh, on the end on someone was throwing it away and so I thought I would take it and get some more room for my vanity and put all my perfumes and everything my lotions and stuff on here now I know y'all guys y'all see all this lotion and all this shower gel down here um I tackled the bath and body work sale that they had where they had like lotions for two dollars or a dollar seventy five and three dollars shower gels and stuff like that so I grabbed a lot of that stuff because you know hey got to take a bath. Don't want to look ashy. So, you know, we use it. We use quite a bit. I had a couple of more than this. Um, as you can see, we started using some of this stuff. And then this here, this perfume I got from a Victoria's Secrets. These perfumes, I think they regularly run like 30 bucks, 29.99 or something like that. And I got these for five for 20 bucks. My daughter has the other one, but these are the two scents that I like. And then she has the other scent that I don't think I got another one of those, I don't think. No, I didn't. 
but yeah, I got these. So I just wanted to show you guys a quick little glimpse, a little quick haul or whatever. And I and I'm sorry that I've been that I was missing in action for so long, but and I, you know what I said to myself. Let me look at you guys when I'm talking. I said to myself, I wish YouTube would have some type of messaging system that you can mess like put a message out there for your subscribers. That would be helpful because you know you don't want to make a video like I worked from home I did I worked from home I worked right there from that bed I had this chair that I'm sitting in over next to the bed and then I had my computer sitting in this chair and so um I would lean over do a little work and then go back to sleep because the medicine had me so groggy but I wish they had like a messaging system like something that you could put out and then all of your subscribers would know you know what you're doing or what you're up to because not everybody I know not all of you guys follow me on Facebook which is where I post most of my stuff um I don't do Twitter a lot I need to start doing Twitter a lot more like I do Twitter but I don't do Twitter like me messaging you guys through Twitter like I don't do that a lot I guess I should I have Twitter I have Instagram and I, I have to start use, utilizing all those things especially when I'm out of commission that way you kind of know guys kind of know where I'm at so yeah but anyway let me go I'm gonna try to do a little cooking um, I'm gonna get out of these clothes because I've been at work all day uh, the kids had today off so that's why I didn't have a video to show you guys what I wore this morning but um, and I've been watching all the inauguration stuff it's so exciting so excited it made me wish that I would have tried to even get there to see it you know because I'm thinking this is his last term this is not going to happen again so anyway um uh just you know just wanted to let you guys know where I was and I will continue to make videos um just my back my back is killing me so I'm gonna probably take some more of my pain medication so that I can sleep well and I'll just take a leave during the week you know, during the day so that I can kind of function a little bit more. But I might have to start taking, well, Aleve is supposed to work. Because I don't want to be taking a whole bunch of medicine, but that Aleve is supposed to take down the swelling stuff. But anyway, I don't want to bore you guys. Anyway, um, just in case you guys wanted to know where I was, that's where I was. And I didn't do a vlog this, this weekend because all you would have did was see me sitting in the freaking bed uh, ordering takeout for the kids during the week and, like, it's crazy. It was just crazy. I couldn't even believe. And people would come and visit me. And my mom came and visited me. My, my girlfriend, Carrie, she came over here a lot to visit me. And people would just even, you know, they would just come get in my bed. My brother, my sister-in-law, all of them. You know, when they come in, I'm like, I just yell in the front room, hey, I'm back here. <laughs> and so they would come in and, you know, kind of sit with me for a while and visit. So it was pretty good, you know. I got the attention. I felt pretty spoiled, so. Anyway, just want to let you guys know that I'm feeling better. Give me a thumbs up for feeling better, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.